Dr. Sanjay Sanyal, welcome to our next demonstration on how to use the interactive digital cerebellum. As I told you, the cerebellum has got a lot of circuits, intracerebral circuits, inputs, outputs, etc., etc., and the students have a lot of difficulty trying to understand them. So therefore, I have created this simple demonstration of how to use the interactive digital cerebellar circuits. Let's say the student clicks here, and immediately all the inputs to the cerebellum from the cerebral cortex, spinal, spinal cord, vestibular system, they all open up in front of the student. And if the student wants to click on any one individual circuit, that also is available for him to view. And if he wants to go back to the welcome screen page, he can see that. Let's say he wants to see what are the circuits inside the cerebellum. And therefore, this is one particular view of the cerebellar circuits inside. And if he wants to see another view of it, he can get the same view. And if he wants to see any one individual, he can click on that and that will also appear in a third fashion in front of him. Then he can go back again and let's see he wants to see what are the outputs. He can see the outputs again from three different perspectives. And finally, if he wants to see the entire summary of all the cerebellar circuits, all he has to do is just click once and then the circuits inside and outside and within the cerebellum will all appear in front of him in a sequential fashion. And then if he clicks again, the next circuits will appear and so on and so forth. They'll keep appearing from different, different parts and different perspectives. Again, this is a very fun and easy way to learn about the cerebellar circuits rather than from reading textual matter from the books. The students find it very easy, very useful, very user friendly, and it has attained a lot of rave reviews. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Dr. Sanjay Sanyal, signing out. Have a nice day.